These days, a lot of us are trying to save some cash, and there are some simple things you can do to save some money right around your home. SNN Local News 6 reporter Grant Boxleitner is on Siesta Key this morning with some tips. Good morning, Grant. That's right, Adrian. Feel good Friday, and we're out trying to save you money. We're at a house at Siesta Key, and I'm joined by Matt Frank of Dwell Green. He's the regional manager. And Matt, let's start right here at the hot water heater. Uh, you've got an infrared camera that you use to to see if the energy is escaping. Yes, uh, you know this is a typical you know electric hot water heater that this homeowner has. Uh, you know they've tried to to wrap it, you know, to conserve some of the the heat, you know, from heat, heat from losing. Um, uh, and uh, you know, as you can see, you know. The temperature differentials in here, you know, range from 125 on the, the surface of the actual hot water heater, pretty warm, you know, yeah. to you know, to basically just room temperature as this outside. So this is conserving some heat, you know, saving some energy. They've also, you know, wrapped their hot water pipes, you know, so, so they don't have to wait so long in the morning to, you know, wait for the hot water to come to their faucets. Always a good idea. Simple no. fix on the weekend. Perfect. Now the air conditioning, uh, this is another great place and a lot of money can be uh, wasted right here. Oh, of course. You know, having a clean filter, you know, change on a regular basis is extremely important. You know, airflow and, and making this thing, you know, work how it's supposed to, you know, is definitely critical for it. So what we do in our home performance evaluations. We look at some of yeah. the basic filters, but there are other kinds. There's other kinds of filters, you know, that, that we, you know, recommend, you know, depending on the client's needs. Um, but, you know, we catalog all this and, you know, we send them reminders, email reminders, you know, change your filter. This is the size. This is the spec of it. Absolutely, Matt. Well, we're going to take you in now to the kitchen and we're going to have some more money saving tips in there. And uh, we're going to start over at the sink. And Matt, this is something that, that someone can take care of with not a lot of cost. Oh, this is the real basic, you know, weekend fix. You know, go out to your local hardware store, pick up some new water sense aerators. And, you know, basically the older aerators that you see on faucets, you know, still have a pretty high flow rate of water. Uh, the, the new ones, you know, have a 1.5 uh, gallon per minute, you know, flow, and it's adequate for doing everyday needs, so. Absolutely. Now, let's look over here to these light fixtures because we know in the attic it gets awfully hot up there, and this is a place where that heat can leak down. Oh, exactly. You know, summertime in, in Florida is pretty hot, and even all year round, you know, attics get, you know, excess of 140 degrees. So this is perfect conduit, you know, that you can see you know, infiltration from the attic, hot, humid air coming into the And let's quickly take that image, if we can, to show the viewers at home just how orange that gets. That means a lot of heat is coming down. Oh, correct. Yeah, this is just, you know, prime area for infiltration into the house, and it makes your air conditioning cycle, humidity levels higher. Uh, and these are simple fixes. You know, you can get retrofit cans to seal these, or, you know, you can do some other fixes, which we, you know, we recommend in our home performance evaluations. Matt Frank with Dwell Green, thank you so much for joining us. Just some money-saving tips, and you don't even have to leave your own home. We are on Feel Good Friday. Grant Boxleitner, SNN Local News 6. Adrian. Some good tips I'll have to implement this weekend. Grant, thank you. One tip, turn off the AC because exactly. it is going to be gorgeous weather-wise. Open the windows. Really nice conditions. We're off to a nice comfortable start. Dew point has already dropped this morning, so yeah, nice weather ahead. We'll talk all about it.